Hi everybody, Kyle and Pablo here once again for Couch Culture. And today we're going to talk about a very famous American series, Friends. Yeah, Friends. How's it going, Pablo? It's going well. You know, Friends here is like the biggest series ever, I think. How do you say reponer? Rebroadcast or repeated. It's repeated a lot. Okay. Is it a regular verb? Is it... To repeat, yeah. Okay. Yeah, uh, so they repeated just uh, last season, uh, last year, the complete uh, series. The whole series, the whole all series, the seasons. All the seasons. Now, how many seasons of Friends are there? I don't know, maybe nine, something like that. Okay, yeah. Now, I must say, I like Friends, but I'm not really crazy about it like a lot of people are. I think it's interesting, but I guess it's famous because of maybe the social dynamic, you know, yeah, it's, a, it's so. an interesting format. You have four friends living together in, a, in an apartment in New York City. Yeah, it's, that's why. And maybe this, this idea for, for a non-American is quite glamorous. People tend to like this typical American lifestyle. Do you, you think that's what makes it interesting? Yeah, it's a glamorous, glamorous lifestyle. Um, yeah, on top of it, we all love to be in a cafe with our friends spending yeah. like four hours a day there yeah it's like not very not very realistic yeah, yeah. we would yeah we would like to be there yeah, yeah. we would like, we to, would be like, like to be like yeah. and living in you know two houses just one in front of the other oh that's true there are two apartments not one that's right two apartments yeah, yeah. okay one is the main one but yeah. the other one with the guys is like just in front and so they are friends and they can like yeah. speak with each other when, wherever they like so yeah it's ideal what we all love to do so yeah but I, I think there are maybe a few flaws let's say in the in the whole premise el concepto no the whole mm -hmm. premise of it because really these they don't work a lot do they yeah they have all of them have a work but a they, job a, a job. job they have a job right yeah but they are not really getting into these jobs yeah but it, they don't seem to be getting paid a lot Yet they have these beautiful apartments in New York City. They're spending money on going out all the time and sitting in the cafe. I don't think it's realistic of the New York lifestyle, but it's kind of glamorous and it's fun to kind of imagine yourself in that, sure. that sort of exciting New York City lifestyle. Like maybe Ross, as a paleontologist, can get uh, more money yeah. but for and, to, and to earn we say ganar okay. dinero when when you work we use the verb to to earn sorry for the interruption but to earn money through work we say people earn money companies we say make money and to win win money that would be like going to the casino right okay. ganar dinero at the casino to win money but yeah he he earns a lot of money because he has a good job yeah but the rest yeah one is like Massage in the masses. A massage therapist. Yeah, something yeah. like that. The other one is a cook. Yeah. So yeah, they, it doesn't fit with their life. But it's an interesting series and an interesting piece of pop culture from the yeah, 90s and the early 2000s, right? Yeah, it's worth to watch it. It's worth watching. It's worth watching. It's worth watching. Yeah, it sure is. All right, guys, and so is couch culture. It's also worth watching, but. You can't watch anymore because we're completely out of time. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.